The live commentary may not reflect this rating. Viewer discretion is advised. Hey everybody, it's Clonoclox and I welcome back more Metroid 2 Return of Samus in the last episode. We uh we we journeyed through the main part of of sec uh, phase four and in this episode and in this episode we are heading we are going to Oh restore our missiles first of all. Or this isn't where the missile station is. Um and in this episode we are going to head into phase five, find where the lob where the acid receded. Dude, stop getting hit by everything. This is I don't if I had the spacer beam I would have been able to uh to hit it easily. I know I could just go back and get the spacer beam, but I'll well, I'm gonna keep the plasma for now. Alright, down here, missile station. We have a total of two ten. I guess I can meet you guys uh, near where the uh, other save point is. Okay, we're here. And now... Right here... oh. I was worried what I would have expected the acid to lower, but it didn't. But it didn't. So, um... And here we are, back with the awesome music. Now over here, this is where the acid lowered. So, oh, also these enemies right here, um, they're great for grinding missiles out of. And the missiles are facing down for some reason, which looks kind of funny. I think it's mostly if they're coming from the side. And we've got even more acid right here. So we're going to, so what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to go through here. There's a Metroid shell right here. Which means the Metro. oh. These guys. These guys drop a lot of health though, so. Uh, you can imagine, as you can imagine, the Metroid must have gone down this corridor. Or is eating its way through it as we speak. Come on, jeez, it's not hard to. If I had the spacer beam, but hopefully this guy, this gives you, this shows you guys why I prefer to have the uh, spacer beam over the uh, over the uh, plasma beam. Is there no music in this area? Or oh, kind is. Can't really hear it all too well. Kind of makes it feel more desolate on this planet, I guess. Jeez, these things look so creepy. They're like land squids. They kind of remind me of uh, those really, cr those really creepy, um, those really creepy, creepy sea squids. Like, you ever seen that one uh video? That one video of some scientists in a submarine, and they saw like a purple squid with big googly eyes that almost looked like a almost looked like a beach toy. Kind of reminds me of that. All right, and here, here is that single Metroid we need to defeat. Come on, there we go. There you go. 
And that was the only Metroid we needed to defeat to move on to the next phase, which means the acid should be receding now. Mm-hmm. But that basically means that we're just going all the way back out of this. To which I guess I can meet you guys at the beginning of it. Okay, um, so we've taken care of that, and that didn't, that didn't lower the acid in this area, so we're gonna have to go further back, I guess. Ow. So, um, what we're gonna want to do is just go back through that ball maze again. We're just gonna want to go through this again. And as you can see, the acid the acid lowered here. And, um, there's not really anything too crazy in here, it's just, it's just two Metroids and an energy station and a missile station. That's why I honestly feel like this area is more filler than it is, um, an actual part. Um... Yeah, like, because all we did, we just, we went through that ball maze, and we went to this one area where there was just a single Gamma Metroid, only to come back and go through the maze again, and, um, and just, uh, and just come all the way back here so we can beat two Metroids, and then go back through the maze again so we can get, the, so we can, so we can progress. This area just seems kind of pointless. Okay, well, um, there's two ways you can go here. You can go left to find an Alpha Metroid and an Energy Station, or up to find a Gamma Metroid and a Missile Station. I say go for the Gamma one first. Beat it! Oh, this enemy. This is like a Helmosaur from Legend of Zelda Link to the Past. You can't hit it from the front, you can only hit it in the back. But, and it will often drop by uh, large energy units that will restore you by, t by uh, 20, so they're good to fight. These things, I have no idea what they're called, but they basically reappear uh, yeah, appear and disappear out of nowhere. But they don't take very long to reappear, and um, probably better to just space jump across here. Which I would probably recommend you do instead. But, no, nah, I might as well at least get through here at least once using them. Ah, uh, what am I saying? Just, just space jump over it. And in here... We have the Metroid. Get it? Come on! There you go. Jeez, these Metroids are like so much more annoying to fight than they need to be. All right, you have a missile. You have a missile station right here. Um, and now we're just gonna. And now we're just gonna go back through that and go the other way. I'll, I'll meet you guys there. Ooh. I got 
These enemies, the, the way they move, makes them hard to fight. Okay, now we're gonna go this way. We're gonna get. So now we're gonna go this way. All right, and we have more of these things, and this time they move back and forth. And I don't know, guys. These things really look like they would be Mario enemies more than they would be Metroid enemies. They're not even enemies, they're just creatures that you can't kill. Well, presumably if, you, if I, presumably if you had a powerful enough weapon, you could kill them, but you don't. And I'm impatient, I'm just gonna... Yeah, why didn't they put this place like before you got the space jump? This area is seriously just filler. There's... All right, over here, there's the Metroid. And there we go. And over here is an energy station. And upon doing that, makes the, uh, makes the acid lower. We now have seven Metroids to get. So I think I'll meet you guys at the beginning of this. Cool. Here's at the beginning of this, and now I'm going to meet you to the beginning of this. Alright, here we are where the acid receded, or I guess lowered. And now we've got to go through this stupid ball maze again. Seriously, what was the point of beating those three Metroids? You went out of your way just to get one, and then you came back to get two more, and now we're going back again to, 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 to proceed. I want, I want to know what the uh, design decision behind that was. This is, I think this is where the, where we go now. This is where the acid went down. This enemy, it like, jumps from the, from one side of the, the room to the other. I should have, I should have let it do that so I could see it attack and pull, I guess. Don't worry, I think we see more soon. Alright, 210. These were already at 13 minutes? Alright, these enemies are cool. They, they... They... They drop, like, these bombs down. And they can actually drop stuff as well. Or get out! Get out of there! Yeah, might... Might want to just avoid them if you can. And you have those creatures that are coming out of the lava. But they do drop a lot of energy. But hey, you came out of the ground. You shouldn't be allowed to do that. <laughs> Alright. Oh, these things. Uh, these are the only instances of these blocks in the entire game. Uh, all you do is just fire a missile at him. That's it. You don't, need, you don't even need to be bolt, destroy both of them. You can just destroy one. Spring ball through. And then they're destroyed. And once you destroy them, they're destroyed forever. There we go. Alright, here we are. Phase 7, and the last four missile tanks are in here as well. They got seven Metroids to get. I 
and going through here. Surprise! Similar to that one Metroid that was in the middle of the path. And... Hey, I'm not gonna let you push me out of the room so your health re regenerates. There you go. Hmm? But seeing as that we're already at 15 minutes, I really think it might be a better idea if we just stop the video. I know we didn't get too much progress done in here. Well, here's one thing we can do. Get this missile tank that's down here. Uh, you know, uh, maybe that maybe that makes up for there not being too much progress. But, um, I'm thinking maybe it might be a better idea if we just end the video now. Because, um, because, uh, if I... Because if I try to do, the, do this whole area um, in the single video, the videos are, we're gonna have another 30 minute long video, and I wasn't too happy with that one, with like the second episode being 30 minutes long. So I, so I think we're gonna end the video here. Here's your save point, and next time on Metroid 2, we're gonna you know, we're gonna go through Phase 7. It's Phase 7, right? Yep, Phase 7. See you guys then. Goodbye.